Hey, hey, what's up, YouTube? Here are Canada and brings another battle. And after five days, and uh, after having an accident with my car, and well, uh, after some snow storm right where I live, I bring another battle. This battle is going to be against Jordan, which happens to be his name, uh, Ninja Monkey Taco, on the Score channel. Uh, well, let's see the team. I have my Kanto team, which I get to love the region Kanto, which is my fav favorite uh, region of all. And well, he has a mix. But well, we're gonna start the battle. I will use my uh, Hillmon Lee, and he will send his Lux Ray, which happens to have the ability Intimidate, which will cut my attack. Uh, the first thing that I do is using knockoff in case he's try, trying to switch into his jellison, which that's what he does. He sends his jellison and well, uh, use knockoff and well, that's super effective. But in case he use a uh, scold and burn my Pokemon, I make a switch using my Venusaur. But actually, he make he predicts that I'm gonna switch my Pokemon and sends my since he's incineroar but since my pokemon has a sleep powder i'm gonna put his pokemon to sleep like the uh, sleepy beauty so now um, i'm gonna make a, another switch because i'm i'm not sure if his uh his incineroar happens to be a choice card so i'm gonna make a switch i'm gonna send my blasters which happens to be my happens to be a mega and now he's going to make a switch sending his Super Saiyan looks way on the battlefield. Well, I'm gonna make I ball my Blastoise, and I first thing that I do is use Water Pulse because it's neutral damage against his Pokemon. And since I know that he's, he used Intimidate, he might be a bit, a little bit def defensive uh, Pokemon, and I might be able to survive the attack. But he used Electric Terrain, which <laughs> that gives me an, another chance to uh, to actually attack this Pokemon since I'm not receiving any attack from him. Now I use Water Pulse. He actually stays with uh, his Pokemon, and well, he's gonna faint. Now he's gonna use a uh, his Pokemon Sceptile uh, with the important ability. He uh, he has Electric Electric Seed, which now. His ability is gonna be activated, and now will send my Venusaur. Well, he actually predict, he actually really predict very well the switch using Sword Dance. Now he has, no, uh, he has no item anymore, and now he's gonna use Acrobatics. You know, you know how Acrobatic works, so that get that gets to kill my Venusaur with just one attack. Now I send my Charizard, which if my Charizard doesn't survive the attack of Acrobatics, that will be a sweep to my team which I get to survive the attack with 26 HP and activates my berry which is a salak berry raising my attack plus one now I'm gonna use the flamethrower which is super effective because up now and my ability gets to be activated that which is uh, the ability is blaze so now he will send incineroar and I will use ancient power because that is super effective against his Pokemon and that's really good damage but he gets to wake up in the first turn now he's gonna use knockoff i don't have any object on my only item on my charizard but that with that range that it has my charizard is enough to kill with just not with the knockoff well or whatever i just said he makes a switch i send my blastoise and receive the water post which is neutral damage against his pokemon and well he's gonna get a little bit confused and this pokemon happens happens to be a choice card which i didn't know yet until way until later he sends his jellison with ability water absorb and well uh we'll use dark pulse i have the dark pulse and thanks to my ability every uh the ability of the pulse whatever it is the name which i forgot erase the attack whatever it he ends with pulse like water pulse or a sphere or something like that or spheres i don't care i don't i don't remember the ability but you know what i mean so i'm gonna use dark pulse one more time super effective enough to kill his jellison 
with well with just two diapers. And well my blasters receive the damage because of the toxic now he's gonna send Incinero which I happens to be faster than his Pokemon which I didn't know yet I just go straight for water potion because I was like I think I can survive one attack of his uh, Incinero if he, he happens to be a choice car right so I actually get to outspeed his Pokemon now he sends uh, his uh, Gallade which I didn't know like I said before I didn't know he was a choice car and now he outspeed my Blastoise and well close combat almost killed my blastoise but i uh, will use water pulse which is neutral damage and plus he lowers his defense because he used close combat i get to kill his pokemon and my blastoise, blastoise will faint as well because of the toxic now last pokemon that he has is glycor which the first thing that i do it will be knockoff because i wanna take his evil eye away from the Gligar, he use Earthquake, yeah. even though that, that actually does a great damage against my Bruce Lee, but I now make a switch using my Slowbro, because my Slowbro has a really good defense, plus I have the key berry to raise my defense, my physical defense, and well, since he doesn't have the evil light anymore, I will use a Skull, because it's super effective, and I think in that range, since he doesn't have the evil light, it will be enough to kill this Pokemon with just one attack and that's gonna be the match against Ninja Monkey Taco Jordan and well I hope you like the battle here at Canon 9 see you next time take care and later bye